Previously on Chapter One. Oh my God, Liv! What happened to me? You were in a car accident. Well, let's start with what you can remember. Don't push her. Give her time. What did you just say? Can you remember any of the men in the car? Zach. He was called Zach. People would kill for what you can do. What's this guy doing? Wait, everybody hold. <gasps> I remember everything. Well, if that's amazing. You've never called me Liv before. Mom? We need to find the others, and she's our best chance of doing that. Okay, he's awake. Let's begin. Hello? Hello? What's going on? What is... Can someone tell me what's going on, please? Where are you going? What? Where is he taking you? Who are you? I don't know. Ah! 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 He's awake. Do you think Walsh is up to this, given what's just happened? He's been briefed. He insisted he'd be fine. You cooperate, this will be a lot easier. Why should I? I mean... Why am I here? Why am I why, why am I in handcuffs? Those cuffs are specifically designed for you, Zach. If you lie, they'll know. And if you piss me off, well. <laughs> so <laughs> I will ask you again. Where was he taking you? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Where are we going? To the safe house. Oh, all right, all right. He just, he told me, uh, he just said a safe house. He's telling the truth. All that we want is your help. <laughs> That's not too much to ask, is it? He says, after electrocuting me, Okay, okay, all right, all right, I'm sorry. Just don't, don't, please. What do you see? That's the car. Hmm. Not just anything unusual about it. It's gone. Perfectly split in two. What do you suppose could have done that? I don't know. Take me back there, Zach. What happened when you crashed? There has always been studies into the human mind and body and that they are capable of things we can only dream of. I believe you three are proof of that. You need to be kept safe to... What is this guy doing? Wait. No, 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 no! Well? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, there was a guy, all right? There was a, there was a man in, in, in front of the car before we crashed. And explain to me how that split the car in two. We're getting nowhere. Ask him about the others, Walsh. 
see if that jogs his memory. What about the other people in the car? There were four of you, right? What were their names? I didn't talk to them that much. I didn't, I didn't get any of their names. Ah! Ah! Right! Hmm, really? Because Olivia seems to know your name. In fact, she seems to think that you were in charge of this whole operation. Olivia. So you do remember Olivia? She survived. Is she all right? Is she hurt? So, um, do you have anyone? Um. Just my mum. I uh, don't really have any proper friends. We used to move about a lot when I was a kid. Um, I used to blame my mum for feeling alone, but I get it now. Never fit in anyway. I've always been um, different. Yeah, me too. I guess that's just the way it is, right? Yeah. So where's your dad? Oh, he uh, left when I was younger. My mum don't really speak about him. Foster homes of all I've known, really. Yeah, what they like? Yeah, you still. But to be honest, none of them really wanted me. They uh, sent me back every time. Yeah, said I was uh, too angry, out of control. I just didn't have any other way to express myself, I guess. I'm a bit off on my own anyway. Hey, we can be loners together. <laughs> Weirdest dream. It's okay now, love. You're safe. <sighs> Sack? No. No, it's me, Mum. You're here with me. <laughs> no, Zach, I'm here. I'm fine. You must be so confused. <laughs> You've been asleep for so long. I know what you're trying to do. And you're not my mom! Oh, please. Please. Please help me. Oh, so you do remember Olivia. Now, do you care to explain to me why she seems to think that you were in charge of the whole upper room? He seems to have a soft spot for the girl. No. Call Reed. No. He's looking after her. Tell him I've got an idea. It was Mr. Hill. All right, he brought us together. Mr. Hill? Is that what he told you his name was? What did he say to you? Must I do this every time I want an answer yeah, from yeah. you? Um, he, he told me that um, he could control it. Control what? My condition. You're referring to those marks on your arms? you the same time they found Zach, but they couldn't put him under, so they moved into another wing. That's what they want from you. They hired me to try and find out what you can... What the hell are you doing? 
Humor me for a moment. Let me see those marks. See, I saw you get thrown from that car. Nobody else would have survived what happened to you. Tim, what the hell is going on? I, I was trying to minimize what you could see. Isn't that what you want? Simulation's dead now, anyway. We've got new orders. Get a transport unit down here to level seven ASAP. Yes, Mr. Reed. again no she needs to be awake for this what, what do you mean what do you mean you saw me oh <laughs> do you honestly believe that all of this was just an accident lights do it My job to bring you in. But then something happened. Something made that car split in half. And me and my team. Well. We got the remains of it. I didn't know that it was gonna happen. Tell me where the others are now! Tried the easy way. Now we go for something a little different. Transport unit, where is it? Any minute, sir. How are you getting on, Reed? We'll be on the move shortly. They're torturing him. If he's any consolation, they're going to be doing the same to you. Oh, oh, I don't know, all right? I've told you everything. I, I told you... I told you everything about Mr. Hill. Forget about Mr. Hill. We know everything about Mr. Hill. We want to know about the other passenger. Where did they go? I don't know what the... If you refuse to help, then Olivia dies. She's Marks. Now, where is she? Where is she? Next door! <coughs> Olivia! Stop! Olivia! Stop! Can you hear me? No! Go off me! Off me! Olivia! 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 Is this really necessary? I'm taking no more chances. No one else has ever broken out of a sin before. together. <laughs> he, he was the first person to make me feel like the problem was a good thing, you know? Like a strength, almost. Yeah, me too. And I never thought there was anyone else out there like me. You know what? This could have been one of the best decisions we've ever made.
Magnificent. After all these years, I finally found them. 